What's good everyone? Thank you again for stopping by. We have another one to check out today from Genre Parfums. Keep it locked. Devin and his team at Genre have consistently been putting out fragrances that have not only been great in quality and performance, but they are also really, really, really nice presentation. Uh, a lot of people have stated that it gives a kind of niche vibe, and Devin has consistently been putting money back into his business so that he can provide a top quality product for the consumer. So today we're gonna take a close look at Genre's Black Cherry, which is an inspiration of Tom Ford's Lost Cherry. Genre's Black Cherry was released in December of 2018. It was released in 30 mil bottles, However, 10 mil bottles are available for purchase if you would like to sample it. So I've been able to communicate with Devin in regards to this fragrance. His main approach to this fragrance was not just to copy a fragrance that was already produced. However, he wanted to recreate this fragrance that was produced by Tom Ford, giving it a bit more backbone to the fragrance in regards to performance, but at the same time, keeping that nice cherry and almond note that was so sought after. With the first spray, I get that this fragrance is a very seductive fragrance. It's kind of a grown-up fragrance. I wouldn't say a, a younger individual couldn't wear it. I mean, I'm young myself, but I think that this is very good for somebody who is mature uh, or somebody who can pull off mature fragrances. This fragrance is described as a unisex fragrance where both men and women can wear this fragrance. I think that it does side pretty well with the masculine approach to it. Um, however, my wife and some other people that have smelled it and on social media have talked that women absolutely love this fragrance. There's quite a few women that absolutely love wearing it. And I think that uh, definitely a woman could pull this off anytime they would like to wear this fragrance. So let's check out the presentation. For Black Cherry, Genre offered a red leather pouch instead of the original black, which I felt added a great touch to their presentation. The bottle presentation is consistent with the other bottles that are within their lineup. Again, it's a cylinder fragrance bottle with a nice flat black label attached to the front and their logo, if you can see, which is embossed in gold. Again, a very elegant presentation. I believe it, it goes very well um, with what they're trying to do and how they are presenting their product. The opening of this fragrance gives a nice black cherry followed by a subtle almond note with the middle notes consisting of griot syrup and jasmine sandback and ending with Peru balsam, roasted tonka beans, sandalwood, vetiver, and cedar. As with genre, they always offer their bottles um, they pretty much look the exact same, all the 30 mil bottles, as you've already seen in the video. They look the same. I do like, again, that the, the bottles are clear. You can see how much juice is left without even having to pull it out of your collection um, in case you need another backup bottle or if you need to restock. Now, I would say with this fragrance, um, I know we've already gone over the notes. The atomizer for this, this one, as with every single genre parfums bottles, they operate exactly the same, identical. They are always on point, in my opinion. They always offer even distribution of the fragrance, which I think is an important factor uh, when deciding if you're going to try a new fragrance house or not. I'll give a couple sprays just to show you guys again. This one, just an awesome even flow of fragrance. And, and I will tell you right now, I mean, this whole room smells like straight cherries. like. It's not a gourmand fragrance by any means, um, but it's just such an, uh, a welcoming fragrance. It's just, it's so lovely and it just, it brings happy memories. It, it kind of, if you got stuff going on in your life and, and stress and stuff like that, get home, spray a couple sprays of this, sit down, read a book, watch some TV. This right here is gonna put a smile on your face. I promise you. If you love fragrance and it's a part of who you are as a person like it is me, this right here is gonna be something that you probably want in your collection. When this came out, I wanted to purchase this fragrance. 
I hadn't smelled Tom Ford's prior to purchasing this one, but when I got this fragrance, I just absolutely loved it. I mean, there's, I'm not, I don't ever try to hype anything up. I just want to offer, again, the most genuine reviews of these fragrances. There's only a small amount of people that have even smelled the fragrances. So what I'm trying to do is, is to let you guys know. So if you do decide to purchase it, you know what you're getting. Um, it's just, it is just such a lovely fragrance. I mean, it really is. I do feel that this fragrance, it leans more towards a colder appeal, maybe winter time. It definitely suits a really awesome date night scent. If you're going to a very formal event, uh, maybe a wedding or going to a really nice formal event, maybe where you have to wear a suit or tie, this right here is going to gain compliments. It's also going to be subtle enough to where it's not overpowering, it's not offensive, but it's going to provide that self-confidence that, if that's one of the reasons you wear fragrance, um, like myself, it's going to provide that self-confidence. It's going to give you that feel knowing that when you walk into this room that you smell good and that everyone, every person that you pass by, I guarantee you, will know that you're wearing this fragrance. And I guarantee you people are going to ask you, what do you have on? Because that's what's happened to me on just a few occasions that I've worn it. And this fragrance lasts all day long. I mean, this, this performance is crazy on this, honestly. Um, I'm getting a solid about four or five hours of solid projection, which is crazy. Um, I know this is EDP, but the projection of this right here, four to five hours, and then the longevity of it, I'm getting eight to nine hours of, of solid longevity before it falls off completely off my skin. Um, to me, for the quality, the price point, which the price point for the 30s is only $25, not including shipping. Um, I think the quality is there, the presentation is there. I really enjoy this fragrance. I believe that it's something if you, again, if you like cherry, if you like fruity fragrances that have a mature appeal, this is probably gonna be something that you wanna check out. I will be offering a sample of this here soon, so make sure that you guys are subscribed to the channel. Also make sure that you click the bell icon so you can get the most current and updated videos that I'm putting out. Um, I just, I am really blown away by this fragrance. I, again, I never hype anything up. I just, I am just really blown away. This is an awesome fragrance. I mean, this really is, um, man, it's, there is nothing that I've smelled like this. Nothing at all. And I, I mean, I, I haven't, I know some of you guys who are watching this video may have more in your collection. I have about 200 bottles right now in my collection. Um, I've smelled quite a few. This one is, is like nothing else. Um, and I, like I said, every single cologne that I have in my collection has a spot in my heart, a specific, you know, it, it's, it takes me somewhere, whether in, you know, a thought, or it just takes me back to a time in my life that was very um, happy and enjoyable, or it takes me maybe a vacation. Maybe I, it was a bottle that I took on a vacation one year, and it just brings all those memories back. This one just gives a nice feeling and it almost kind of slows down time for me. When I have this one on, um, I'm just sitting relaxed and it just, it just gives me that nice vibe. Something I really love about this fragrance. Please make sure you guys check out my Facebook also. The link's on my banner on my front page on YouTube. And if you definitely, if you want to try and check out some genre parfums, uh, the link is again in the description below. Uh, I would encourage you to try them out. They have sample packs if you don't want to commit to the whole 30. Um, that's fine. Uh, I definitely suggest check them out. See what they're about. See if it's something that you like. They're gaining a lot of popularity pretty quick. I believe when I joined the page, there, there wasn't half the people that are on there now on the Facebook group. Um, Devin is very personable. Um, he will message you individually and talk with you uh, just like he does all of his customers. I think Devin puts a lot of quality time and also money into his business again. And he ensures that his fragrances are up to the standard prior to putting them out. Like I said, I, I do wanna give a sample of this away. I, I'm very excited about that. I always love to get back and I definitely want more people to try genre. Uh, I think you would be very impressed with the quality that they're putting out for the price point that you're paying. Thank you again so much for stopping by. We got some new videos coming out as always. 
And as always, I got some new fragrances coming in. Thank you again and be blessed.